What is going on, Governor? It's just cool here, and today we're gonna show you what we got for the two plus million T5 cavalry that we've had die over the course of this KVK. Hello, my friends, welcome back. Today we're gonna be showing you more of the insane reports from our KVK where we're getting two for one, five for one. 10 for 1, 20 for 1 value, trading, battling against three separate kingdoms at the same time, and man, it's been absolutely crazy. If you like Rise of Kingdoms videos where we show you insane war coverage and footage, you better like and subscribe because there is so much of that that's coming, and man, it is so fun to watch. So let's talk about what we uh, got from the 2 million plus T5 cavalry that we used in rallies and have now uh, died. Among other troops that we've had die, our peak power was 140 million. We're down to 115 million. If we get a look at our stats real quick, you can see here that the number of dead we have is at 4.4. Before this KVK, that was 1.8. Every single one of my dead in this KVK is a T5 troop, so you can do the math on that. Now, the uh, other thing I can point at is my kills. My kills have gone way up, and the majority of those are actually kills from leading rallies or being in rallies or defending structures. Uh, I, have, I have been on some open field fighting, um, but not nearly as much as I would like. And so that means most of this work that I did is for keeps, baby. Most of that work is for keeps. Uh, so there you go. You can see some of these stats around the T4 and T5 kills that we've had recently <clears throat> in this KVK. Specifically, if we go to our Crusader achievements, you can see here for the individual achievements that we have pulled down. 29 and a half million kills toward the 50 million kills we need for these sweet rewards off to the side faith level five let's get right into the reports we showed you yesterday a small number of the reports this by the way is just some of a loot pinata that we hit uh, loot pinata is the name we give to a city that has troops that look like this and loot that looks like this. <laughs> yeah, baby, loot pinata. Um, so we hit one. Oh, yeah, and commanders. Look at these commanders on the wall. Garrison commanders, people. Use a garrison commander. This Freddy, I mean, I know he's expertise, but he would be better as the secondary in a Sun Tzu primary. That would have been, like, moderate, but still not great. But, like, this Minamoto? Come on, Sun Tzu's epic. Sun Tzu primary, Freddy secondary, if that's what you're going to do. And even Freddy might not be the right choice, but I am impressed with the expertise, Freddy. Let's continue on here. Um, let's get back to the report goodness. These are all reports that I have was involved in. I have more reports that I was not involved in, by the way. For instance, with a double rally that I thought was pretty cool. This is a double rally on a flag that Hulk defended. Now look, Hulk has earned his name, in case you have not noticed. He took a rally from an Attila Takeda... Uh, that Attila Takeda is a 5553, and the Takeda is expertise. Uh, we've got a Wu Zetian and a Richard I. If we get a look at the damage, we've got 167,000 dead for us and 216,000 dead for them. And in the second rally, we've got a Khan Saladin. Uh, the Saladin is not even expertise. My gosh. 5551 uh, is the Saladin. Uh, the Khan is expertise. We, of course, want positive here as well. 100,000 dead for us and 135,000 dead for them. That's taking a double rally, y'all. Taking a double rally. So I'm feeling pretty strong about winning always on defense, winning always on offense. And I'm saying always, but like, you know, obviously there's some occasions where we're caught off guard and we don't have the right captain or... There's a flag partially full and somebody's kind of derping around and not paying attention. Uh, but for the most part, it's insanely positive. And let me just show you more of these reports. We did literally just a fraction, but these are so juicy. I mean, look at this. These are all things that we were involved in with our troops on the line to die. Somebody count those up if you can. I don't know. Uh, speaking of counting things up if you can... 
I actually have the math from yesterday's video card up in the top. You're going to want to see that and the reports associated with it. Let me pull up those numbers for you real quick. In the reports that we had in the last video, Kingdom 75 had 2.5 million dead and 5.1 million wounded. The other com kingdoms all combined had 9.41 million dead and 26.3 million wounded. And guess what? These reports that I'm going to be showing you on the screen now, like they're all like this. So just, you know, I got a hundred of them. You can do the math. Let me get the last one that we showed up on the screen. I believe it was this one. All right, here is where we last left off. This is the next report in the list. And in this rally, we have 622,000 die. They have 948,000 die. This is on the defense and expertise, Charles Martel and Richard I. Bummer we can't see the builds they were using, so we can math the heck out of that, do some science on what's an optimal build. But we've got uh, 38,000 sev wounds for them, 42,000 sev wounds for them, 54,000 sev wounds for them. Swarming the rally, 115,000 sev wounds, 109,000 sev wounds, 60,000 sev wounds, 28,000 sev wounds. Uh, this person gets dead. Oh no, this is the counter rally. So we took a counter rally in this particular instance. We had 573,000 hit the hospital. They had 637,000 hit the hospital and somebody filled up their own uh, hospital and had some dead troops. Here we've got 95,000 they had hit the hospital, 42,000, 34,000, 17,000. Oh, 199,000 hits the hospital. Oh my God, 40,000, 212,000. Yikes. Wow, wow, wow. 76,000, 101,000, 42,000, 41,000. Okay, and... On to the next report. I mean, there was a point in time where I said, okay, like the thing we're going to do is launch Attila Takeda rallies until we turn this thing around. Uh, ooh, here we, ooh, geez, y'all, oh, vacant. What are y'all doing? We So we caught somebody off guard here. They weren't ready for the hit. 190,000 dead for us, uh, 533,000 dead for them, plus 175,000 sev wounds. And people try to swarm it, 134,000, 58,000. 48,000. Here's another rally. Uh, this one is much more even. I find that fascinating. I wonder what they were doing. They've got a build uh, here that maybe made a difference. There's uh, Charles and Richard, both expertise. 136,000 dead for us, 176,000 dead for them. And then uh, again, the Sev wounds, the trades are just completely out of hand. The trades are completely out of control. And uh, thank you again for the folks who did the math in the previous video to total up the total dead and uh, wounded from these reports. I thought that was pretty amazing. Here's another report that like, hmm, look at that. Uh, you know, everybody's like, oh, it's broken. But here you've got a Charles Martel and a Richard the uh, First, and 246,000 dead for us, uh, 276,000 dead for them. 87,000 sev wounds for them, and the swarm again. 167,000 wounded, 169,000 wounded. Oh, and now she's taking dead. Oh, 28,000 dead, and the 68,000 wounds. Oh, 31,000 dead, and 113,000 wounds. 145,000 wounds, 162,000 wounds, 131,000 wounds. Jeez, they just keep swarming. 150,000, 64,000, uh, 177,000, 55,000, and we're taking like 10% of that in most cases. Here is a counter rally. We take 201,000 sev wounds, and they dish out 101,000 sev wounds. The significance of the counter rally is that you can have 2 million troops, and we could have a max of 1.5 possible this was a rally where I should have pulled the punch a little sooner uh, because maybe we couldn't keep it full for some reason. 107,000 sev wounds over there. 30,000 sev wounds over there. Continuing on. Next report. I mean, this stuff is nuts. What do we have here? Oh boy, this is a good one. We got the Charles Martel combo again. 393,000 dead for us and 564,000 dead for them. Uh, we're trading 50% positive, which is pretty good. 
Uh, some Sev wounds involved here. Somehow I hit the map. That's awkward. We'll jump back to that. All right, I think this is where we were leaving off. 312,000 dead for us, 486,000 dead for them. Uh, Charles Martel and Richard the First. Bunch of Sev wounds on the swarm. Uh, there's Meg. Meg W. Anna War, another 155,000 Sev wounds. 82,000, 89,000, 140,000, 136,000, 104,000, 85,000, 54,000. Dude, this person, Knordist. I'm telling you, I have some reports. They got a lot die before they figure out this was happening. 42,000 Sev wounds, 45,000 Sev wounds. Oh my gosh. What do we have here? 271,000 dead for us, 485,000 dead for them. Again, expertise to Charles and Richard on that wall. And, oh, jeez. Harjan, 84,000 dead, 132,000 sevs. 5,000 dead, 64,000 sevs. Yikes, 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 yikes. Yikes, continuing on. Uh, this uh, is a counter rally. The counter rally hits, and I must have canceled there. Alliance flags were attacked. Here's a defense. Negan at the helm. We have 107,000 dead. They have 211,000 dead. Again, I just, like, very impressed that they continued to battle uh, despite losing trades on both offense and defense. Uh, here we go again. Oh, jeez. <laughs> For 455,000 dead for us, 1 million dead for them, and 329,000 sevs, 218 sevs, wow, uh, 184 sevs, I mean, I, I can't even say severely wounded, I just have to say sevs now, 178,000 sevs, 233,000 sevs, oh, 183 sevs, 133 sevs, 195, 200. 43. Wow. My God. Here's another one. 212,000 dead for us. 456,000 dead for them. It's the expertise, uh, Charles and Richard. Again, it's uh, El Swan Mora on the defense captain there. Bunch of Sevs all over here. I mean, I just. Pfft. Wow. Continuing on, we've got another Attila Takeda rally. Swan Mora at the helm again. Uh, 438 sevs are uh, dead for us and 729 dead for them, including 227 sevs, 136,000 sevs, 111, and some folks showing up, but not actually hit. Wow. Oh, that's a counter rally. Here's a counter rally on us with Khan's cow. Uh, and did I say cow? Khan cow? Moo. Uh, 316 for us, 327 for them. So like, eh, who cares? Uh, oh, no. Rowdy. <laughs> Rowdy, your hospital. <laughs> 110,000 dead and, oh, that's a full hospital. 62,000 dead. Yikes. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> I don't even remember this. I don't even remember this. 592,000 dead for us and 1.246 million dead for them and 388,000 Sevs. I mean, like, again, immensely impressed. Oh, there's 172. Oh, no. No, oh, no. 35,000 dead and... Oh, what? Oh, this is a counter rally. This is a counter rally. And we're trading positive in a counter rally, okay? So we're rallying something. And not even putting skill damage onto this counter rally. We're not even putting skill damage onto this counter rally. And this is what we did to it. All right. Wow. Were these not expertise? They were. Okay. Continuing on. Continuing on. Oh, my gosh. Boom. Yikes. Another almost 200,000 sevs. Oh, another two for one. 389,000 dead for us. 702,000 dead for them. We have uh, Charles and Richard. Wow. Wow. 139,000 sevs, 82,000 sevs, 111,000 sevs, 170 sevs, 213 sevs, 
90,000 sevs, 150 sevs, 91 sevs, 47 sevs. Continuing on, well, it's like the same report all over again. 392,000 dead for us, 773,000 dead for them. Looks like we've got a new captain here, Peerless LA31. And, oh, geez, look at that. Ethelfled Constantine taking one for the team, but 200,000 sevs is the price. Hope those were T4s. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. There's another 200,000 sevs. There's another 200,000 sevs. 111, 47. Wow. Wow. All right. Continuing onward. Continuing onward. What do we have here? What do we have here? Is this an open field fight I saved accidentally? It looks like it is. Inconsequential. We'll just delete that. The open field fights, that's not interesting. All right, here we go. Mean Machine, Guan, Alex rally. Y'all want to see this, right? Guan, Alex, because guess what? That Guan's expertise, baby. Whoa! Expertise, Guan Yu, with an Alex against a Constantine Richard. Now, this is an interesting pair. Uh, Meg W. Anna at the helm. That is an expertise, Constantine. Bravo for you for that. 193,000 dead for them and 124,000 dead for us. 60,000 sevs. And as we cruise down here, 94,000 sevs for them swarming. And some swarming that looks much more even uh, against an Alex Guan. Much more even against an Alex Guan. Ooh, except for this. 26,000 dead on the swarm. Uh, hospital filled up there for that player. All right, continuing on. What do we got? Ooh, here we are, launching another rally. Boom. 363,000 dead for us, 688,000 dead for them. Wow. Uh, that is Meg Anna's Expertise Constantine and an Expertise Esong. Very good commander choices. I love those commanders. Uh, Sev Wounds, 155, 34, 161. I mean, look, you know, these are commanders that I reviewed in my tier list, by the way. Legendary tier list. Carter's up in the top. I think it's pretty accurate. I think it was pretty accurate. Uh, 180,000, 56,000, 59,000, 35,000. Again, if someone could do the math on these, I'll pin the comment. What's the grand total? Negan on the defense, uh, 352,000 dead for us and 234,000 dead for them. So I think this might be one of the first positive trades we've seen for the opposing side that at least I was involved in. Uh, and it is an Attila Takeda, and they did swarm it a little bit. They did swarm it a little bit bit hard to say what the circumstances were exactly that they would have traded positive could be that we were having trouble keeping it full because there was lots of stuff going on could be that they just traded positive oh wow look at this one <sighs> 161,000 dead for us and 988,000 dead for them Richard Primary, Charles Martel Secondary. Oh, and they're not expertise. And they're not expertise. Catastrophic. Oh, and look at this swarmer. 102,000 dead on the swarm. 177 sevs, 118 sevs, 47 sevs, 77 sevs, 45 sevs. And over here, 417,000 dead. 733,000 dead. Let's check to see if they were expertise. Didn't think I had to even do that, but I guess we still do. Charles and Richard, okay. 104,000 sevs, 101,000 sevs. Oh, here's where I think it happens. I knew I remember Knordis got wrecked on one of these. 15,000 dead. Oh, no! 47,000 dead. 27,000 dead. Yikes. Oh, oh. 111,000 dead? Are those T5 or T4? Oh, they're T5! <sighs> wow. Wow. 58,000 dead. I mean, 28,000 dead. I mean, looking at this, and like, these reports go on and on and on and on. Because there was a point where we dug in our heels and I said, Attila Takeda for like 20 hours, the entirety of my being awake, like I'm just Attila Takeda. <laughs> uh, 29, 299,000 dead for us. Ooh, Wu Zetian. All right, we have a meta commander showing up. 
We have a meta commander showing up here, 508,000 dead for them. Let's get a look at their woo. Oh, it's not expertise. That seems really important. All right. All right. Um, 165,000 sevs for them. Uh, oh, that, see, I knew I remembered, like, Canortis just, like, did not know what was happening to his troops or didn't clear his hospital or didn't care. 51,000 dead, 150 sevs, 168,000 sevs, 37,000 dead and 141 sevs, 62,000 sevs, 59,000 sev, uh, dead, oh, and 92,000 sevs, 37,000 dead, 99,000 sevs, yeah. 110,000 sevs. Oh, jeez. 123,000 dead. 11,000 dead. 45,000 dead. 132,000 sevs. 61,000 dead. Oh my gosh. 154,000 dead. What? 74,000 dead. Oh my god. Stop it. We'll do a couple more of these. And then we'll cut it here. We're going to have to do a lot of these videos. I mean, these reports, I don't know about you. Is this entertaining? Do you find this entertaining? Let me know in the comments. Are you enjoying looking at these reports? And I'll give you my full analysis of um, everything that I, I mean, I'll science the heck out of this for you as to like how this all works um, in a future day, in a future video. 200, uh, 361,000 dead for us and 598,000 dead for them. Is it expertise? I believe, yes, El Valkyrie is expertise. Oh, no. Remember, I knew I remembered, like, this name because this poor player just, I must not have realized. 138,000 dead, uh, 72,000 sevs, 60,000 sevs, 46,000 sevs, uh, 96,000 dead. Yikes, yikes, yikes. 185,000 sevs, 156,000 sevs, hundred. 186,000 sevs, 94,000 sevs, 26,000. Crazy, 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 crazy. All right, one more. One more. Just one more. This is maybe a little one. 268,000 for us and 382,000 dead for them. 74,000 sevs. So we'll leave it here for now. We need to cover more of these reports. They're insane. They're fun to look at, I think. Let me know in the comments what you think of this. I also have the footage of basically all of these rallies as they were happening. Do you want to see? Like, do you want to watch Attila Takeda in action? Are the reports what you want to see? You let me know. Whatever it is, we'll hook you up. All right, we'll hook you up. And for those of you who, I don't know, like I I saw, I, I saw some comments that like, you know, oh, this Attila Takeda thing, like, I broadcasted exactly what I was doing with my commander sculptures. I just want to call that out, right? I did say I thought it was very wise to save sculptures to see what was going to be king of the meta. And then when we figured out what was king of the meta, we invested our sculptures there, right? And we've been saying that for it, for months and months and months that we thought that was a good idea. We did it before the last KVK. We're constantly saying, like, do I have a reason to invest? And if there's a takeaway from this, one of them would be that it is very powerful to save your sculptures for the right thing at the right time. I mean, in one of my very first videos in, in Rise of Kingdoms, I said that this game is very much about the right action at the right time. Maybe I'll even put a card up in the top. It's sort of hilarious to look at my video um, back then because it's, like, so old. And, like, I don't even have a face camera. And I'm just talking. And I'm like, what is going on, governors? Hello. And like, I don't know. Lots changed. But but like the right action at the right time. One of them is when do you invest in commanders and like what commanders and all that good stuff. Um, the most powerful kingdom is the one that's got the flexibility of investing in what will work in the meta at that exact moment in time. And that is the thing that we have done. The other thing that I think is really important is that the whales in your kingdom are responsible whales. Uh, responsible means that they are doing what is needed for the kingdom rather than their personal accounts. I mean, like, I was really interested in, like, getting Guan and Leo to, like, a really cool place and doing all this stuff with them and sunset and field fighting. But I was like, you know what? Um, there is a correct answer, I think, at this moment in time for some commanders to invest in. And uh, these two, Attila Takeda, 
I think are in that bucket of amazing commanders. Oh uh, my gosh. My friends, hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Again, huge props to the folks that we are battling against. I continue to be so impressed that they continue to fight into such overwhelmingly negative conditions for their commander base. Um, yeah. Wow. Wow. Uh, I don't I don't even I don't even know. We're having fun. I hope they're having fun. Um, you know, this this has been a heck of a KVK. We're very thankful for that. We really appreciate it. It's really cool that there's, you know, fighting almost 24/7 and you know, people seem to be pretty sportsmanlike about it for the most part. Um, so again, tremendously impressed by the fortitude of these kingdoms that we're battling against. Very impressed by the dedication and fortitude of our allies, taking a three-on-five. Um, hopefully y'all are having a grand old time wherever you are in KVK or Rise of Kingdoms. We're out of here. Until next time, you have fun smashing the kingdom. And P.S. Protect your troops. Troop responsibly. Troop responsibly, people. Here's a pro tip at the end of the video. If you made it this far, pro tip. Pro tip. If you're on an alliance that doesn't have the meta commanders. Why the heck are you taking rallies? Get out of there. <laughs> my opinion. My opinion, right? Like, don't dutifully, like... I'm not saying the folks we're battling against are doing this, but, like, if your alliance doesn't have your captain on, like, don't fight. All right. Anyways. I'm out of here. Peace.